So the airplane behind me is a uh, NASA 836. Uh, it, it is uh, the oldest F-15 on the, on the planet today. Uh, came to NASA in 1993, so we've had it, in all, for, had it for almost 30 years. Um, and it had, a, it had a pretty good history before us. Uh, it started its life in 1974, so it's 48 years old as it sits there right now. So this airplane's been used historically for high-speed research of, of anything supersonic. So this will fly up to Mach 2.5, and we, we routinely take it to Mach 2. Uh, we have several fixtures on the outside of the airplane. What we've been researching is uh, air data systems and, and uh, air uh, measurement systems of that kind. So a new pitot tube, a new sensor, a new static port, a new any kind of sensor that needs to go uh, high supersonic. We mount it on a pylon on, on the center line of the airplane and take it out uh, to various flight conditions. What you get is an airplane that's a thousand pounds lighter than every other F-15 on the planet and it, with the most current engines in it. So this is a hot rod. It's, it's probably the fastest F-15 out there. Uh, we can take two F-15s and uh, you know, one that's 10 years newer or even 20 years newer and this will leave it in the dust uh, every single time. You just cannot keep up with it with anything we have. It's that fast. So it's a great research uh, platform for NASA. Uh, it doesn't have the avionics, but if you need something to go fast, it'll go fast.